So what this means is we've got to have a little bit different definition of what fun in the workplace is. Used to be that it was that pizza party, or let's tell jokes in the break room, or we'll have comics in the break room, we'll, we'll have fun at our staff meetings. Yeah, all that, that kind of works from time to time, allows us to blow off a little bit of steam, but a lot of that is just kind of like icing on a cake. Now, who here likes icing? Everybody like icing? Yeah, we all like the icing on the cake, and that's great. But those fun event type things, those are just the icing. We've got we to love what is underneath it. And so if underneath all that, that cream cheese icing that we think is maybe a carrot cake, which happens, happens to be my favorite, if underneath that is mud and pine needles, <laughs> that's going to be one ugly cake. I'm not going to enjoy this experience of eating this cake. Yeah, the icing is OK, but I'm going to move on. I'm going to find some other cake to eat. And that's the problem that a lot of times that managers fall into is they focus on the icing and not what's underneath. They focus on the what and forget about the why. And that's what we've got to do as leaders. That's what we've got to do as managers. Focus on that why behind what is fun. And when we do that, boy, it's transformative. People engage. They perform. They stay. So in that way, fun becomes a competitive advantage. It becomes a competitive advantage to attract and retain and perform in today's workplace.